Rockies, four streets. The, these four grab the car bank, Concordia 63, Beluga restaurant director key, Concordia security room key. Those those four get the stairway key cheap and offers a cut through. I think, I think it's worth having. Uh, Concordia office room key is good if you're going to have the 64 apartment key. We'll get back to that in a moment. Terror group ars um, armory key is good if you're going to be over there hitting that safe. There's a safe directly across the, it's um you don't need a key for the safe but if you're gonna hit the safe might as well hit the armory key because it has some good uh boxes to hit in there skybridge key is solid but you can't buy this one you have to find it in raid um these three i'm testing so far the check 13 key has been pretty solid the abandoned factory mark key has been okay uh check 15 it's pricey and isn't entirely needed you can still make bank none, none of these three are needed are these these are a mil each and this one was three mil none of these three are needed to make really good rubles but they're not the worst and then concordia 64 at 150k i would i would cop that yeah 100 all right let's see what we get out of this mark room big money bam okay okay dog tax case and g28 dvl I pulled a lot of VSSs out of the mark room. And they're really not worth. I don't even know if the DVLs were taken. It's like 85k, I think. It's gonna take up eight slots. Once I fold it at least. It's not worth taking. It's too heavy. Make sure I'm not missing anything. Honestly, I, I personally recommend not spending a bunch of money on these expensive keys. I would, um, like if you get the key and die with it, sure, run it. And even then, I think these keys vendor pretty well, so you don't even really need to do that. I mean, the mark room keys vendor for how much you can flea market them for. Yeah, Streets has so much great loot on it that you really don't need to drop a, um, a lot of money on these expensive keys. Like the keys that are, that are cheap and you can make your money back on in just one run. And then the other 39 runs of them are profit. Hell yeah. Get them. Like any key under, you know, a few hundred K, then super worth. Is Tarbank heavily contested? Not at all. I don't think I haven't gone in there once to hit it and it be open before I got there. And I'll go late in the round. I'll hit it right now. I'll show you. I will show you the world. Whose laser was that? Yeah, I can. Right now, I'm checking out the uh, the expensive keys, so. See, it's not bad. 580 USD, 21K, and 260, 268. The key's like 40K. Pretty cheap. Honestly, I would do the same loot run, just don't hit the key rooms. I wouldn't go over to hit the marked room at the abandoned factory. I'm going out of my way to check that one just to see what we get out of the marked room for fun. Like this, this same loot path that I'm taking for check building here. Phenomenal. You don't need any keys for it. Some of the keys would help. But I'm a firm believer that on streets, you really don't need the keys. You can make bank without them. Concordia area, you're going to want keys, so you can avoid that. The abandoned factory area, you're going to want keys, so you can avoid that. And even then, you can actually still go there and make money, so I take that back. Because there's, like, tech crates and stuff that you could hit. Lexus dealership's really good. You don't need keys for that. I'll show that in a moment. These are the Iron Gate keys. They're not bad to have. I don't think they're amazing, though. Check 15 is a great example of a key that's hell overpriced. You need it for the quest line. So that's the main reason it carries such a hefty price. But 20 use key, 3.1 mil. So I paid for it. The good thing about it is you can jump up here and look inside. So we got a stem in there. Got Bitcoin on the ground. So we'll hit it. Uh, 
a riskier loot here too uh the check building yeah this is definitely um probably the highest priority area on the map double bitcoin hot dog all right it's a pretty good one no maybe 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 just maybe I think he's worth all right let's go check the uh the mark room this mark room i've had good luck with i think out of my five uses on it i have pulled four key or four cases so far what key was that the one that got the double bitcoin the check 15. this is the check 13 mark room key the mysterious room key appreciate it, wolf here we go big money big money big money and then dog's case all right i mean so far it's been pretty good which i probably have just gotten pretty lucky with it Out of the six uses now, I've pulled five cases. Boy sounded so heavy. Oh, dude, I thought it was gonna be a player running at me that had like just all the loot. <laughs> dude, he sounded. Ugh. Oh, dude, I'm so close to max strength. the armory key the tier group armory key you like a red rebel or a taiga out of this uh these types of green cases it's rare but it can happen what does max strength do it removes the weight of your weapons so like the five kilograms Six kilograms. Dang, okay, okay. Good one. Yeah, well, they won't weigh anything. Cross over to Beluga. Thank you for the room. You don't need a key for that room. This one, you do. This is the Beluga director's office. You get rare items on the desk on this side and on the other side too, right there. And you got the filing cabinets and the PC block. Boom. And this is the stylo beta elevator. Give me something good here. Two slot item, broken LCD. That's not good, but I'll take it. So we got a dog tags case and a dog's case around. That's pretty nice. All right, let's go see what we get out of check 15. Actually, jump up on the ridge here and look inside. There's a lion, bone, a lens, and a roller. I'll take it. I'll take it. The bowels. I don't know who. Oh, and a Bitcoin. That's a good room. Not bad, not bad. Second use on the room. No, actually third. Yesterday we got a graphics card and a clock. And 
that was on one use and then an SGC tin a teapot an actual parrot and a GP coin <laughs> 